I, I gotta say, I'm incredibly excited to be a part of your firm. I mean, uh, <laughs> you, the clients you have are absolutely... Fuck the clients. Your only responsibility is to put meat on the table. You got a girlfriend? I'm, I'm married. I have a <clears throat> wife. Her name's Teresa. She cuts hair. Congratulations. Thank you. Think about Teresa. Name of the game? Move the money from your client's pocket into your pocket. Right. But if you can make the client's money at the same time, it's advantageous to everyone. Correct? <laughs> no. <laughs> Number one rule of Wall Street. Nobody... I don't care if you're Warren Buffett or if you're Jimmy Buffett, nobody knows if the stock is going to go up, down, sideways, or in fucking circles. Least of all stockbrokers. Mm -hmm. right? It's all a fugazi. You know what a fugazi is? Well, fugazi. It's a uh, fake. Yeah, fugazi, fugazi. It's a wazi, it's a woozy, it's a fairy dust. It doesn't exist. It's never landed. It is no matter. It's not on the elemental chart. It, it's not fucking real. <laughs> right? All right? All right. <laughs> Stay with me. Mm -hmm. We don't create shit. We don't build anything. No. So if you got a client <clears throat> who bought stock at eight mm -hmm. and it now sits at 16 and he's all fucking happy, he wants to cash in, liquidate, take his fucking money and run home, you don't let him do that. Okay. Because that would make it real. Right. No, what do you do? You get another brilliant idea, mm -hmm. a special idea, another situation, another stock to reinvest his earnings and then some. And he will every single time because mm -hmm. they're fucking addicted. And then you just keep doing this again and again and again. Meanwhile, he thinks he's getting shit rich, which he is on paper. Mm -hmm. But you and me, the brokers, right. we're taking home cold hard cash via commission, motherfucker. Right. 